of Valkyria. Another scion to the Valkyra? This world has no need for two. Hello and welcome back to Valkyrie Chronicles. I thought it might be just an idea to reapply the context of all the crazy shit that's currently happening. So, let's continue. <laughs> Let me catch you up on the current situation. Great! W last time on Valkyria Chronicles, that should happen. The enemy is centered around the camp they've set up smack in the middle of the combat area. Your squad will begin at this point. High Command is still calling for an all-out offensive. I have faith in your so soldiers' victory. Sure. Your objective is the occupation of the enemy's base camp. The enemies of how curious think they've been neutralized by our own. This is a rare opportunity. To make the best of it and try to claim some ground. Can I can I use Alicia as a Valkyria then? Uh, all decisions regarding the Valkyria from here on out will come from the captain or highest rank officer present. No. Me. Me. Ah. Uh, so do I? Okay, I, I automat. No, no, I don't want four. I automatically have four. Uh. Oh, looks so Rosie's required. Largo's required. I ain't got no Alicia either. Great. Freaking great. <sighs> okay, well, I am really not sure what the best uh, deployment would be, so. Now let's we'll see. Combat now. Stay sharp out there. That's the plan. Okay. Concentrate on taking their base camp. Squad 7, move out. Everyone's taking the whole Valkyria thing really, really well at the moment. <laughs> Boss, what's happened to Alicia? I don't know, but that blue flame is the same as that Valkyria's. You don't mean... you saying Alicia's Valkyria? It looks like she's acting unconsciously. Get too close, she might attack us. Oh, you actually think so? Hmm. I'm worried, but... We're better off watching for now. In the meantime, we strike their camp. Okay.
Thank you very much, Alicia. That, that's helpful. That's very helpful. Okay! How many? You don't have like a weak spot like a tank to you, like from your behind. Oh my. Oh, I can turn the camera. Okay. I'm obviously not controlling it. Wow, okay. So basically, I can't control her at the moment. No matter what I want to do. Okay. No? Okay. I tried to control her, but... This seems... Like I could take their base camp really easily. Honestly. Our... Wait, and there's this whole area back here. What the fuck? Okay, something weird's gonna happen. It seems way too easy for its own good. Okay. Which of you wanna be the, uh... Oh, my. Which of you wanna be the guy... under pressure? Oh, okay. I didn't even realize she had that. Well... I'm going to do what I normally do and save at the beginning, you know, just to figure out what's going on in case I want to redo the whole thing. A lot of mines out here. You can all do this. So... We said that we thought they might attack us, yeah? Or she might attack us. So... Let's just go, go the rest of the way, I guess. See if she does, for one. Try not to leave yourself open. Um... So watch me dance. Time for a quick step. Guys, don't tell me that was the entire thing. No. Yep, yeah, nope. I figured it wouldn't be. That would have been silly. I'm going to stand by the possibility of redoing this all. Especially if I could have just let her go, like, another turn to keep destroying things. Because there's still a lot of things still alive there. Alicia! Oh, shit. Medic! Medic! What happened? It looks like Alicia's passed out. Can you get her back to base for me? Yes, sir. Wh what now? I don't know. Massive tanks are approaching from the north and south. What? Be careful, Lieutenant. It's a pincer attack. <sighs> they left the camp open as bait to lure us in. Those tanks fire incendiary rounds. The impact explodes into a broad blaze. That flame can get at you even in trenches and takes a while to die down. Be careful. Change of plan, Sevens. Hold the camp and take down those tanks. Um... Gothia's base camp. Mm. Okay. You know what, guys? I think I'm gonna redo this. The because... To Prepare to intersect. Unless I can take this, actually take this thing out with this. So many times it's been brought up like, oh, use this to take out them at their weak points, but then it doesn't ever <sighs> fucking work. Urgh. No. It always just damages the damn treads. Are you alright? Okay, what is the actual situation now? They came from here. Oh, does that count? This counts as our base camp now. 
Oh no, yeah, I want to restart this for sure. Uh, I want to... Oh no. I need to actually establish a defense at that base camp. And not just, like, let these guys show up and... Shit, man. Okay. You know, yep, yep, yep. I, I, I want to restart this and do that, definitely. Just looking at the situation. I'm a bit too fucked for my own good at the moment. Okay, I adjusted my deployment a little bit because I, I want to get over and uh, bring people in there rather than uh, everywhere else. Um, Rather than that, because there's no base camp here for me to undeploy people either, so... <laughs> so I figured, yeah, maybe I should restart this since I'm like literally a turn in. So basically, my idea now is I want to clear out these fuckers for one. I do want to do that, and I want to get behind them, and I want to get in a situation where basically I have a ton of turns, I can bring reserve people in, and I can basically attack them before they really have a chance to do much to me. That is the idea, at least. And... Boom! Oh, not quite dead. I'm on it! Okay. So... My idea and hope... Nice work. Keep is to down. hide this guy. Oh, he totally has a visual on just like, okay? shotting me there, doesn't he? So does that tank, sort of. Okay? Mm, gotta be careful. Well, okay. No, no, no. That's, that, that, that's, that's good enough. I want to see what happens if I let this go another turn. Okay, so I want to... I do want to take it this turn. Or if they only request one reinforcement, I'm perfectly fine giving it another turn. I'm not too worried about getting a good grade on this. Under light fire. I more want to be safe about it. And see what this does. You're gonna attack the tank? Or are you going to try to take the base? God damn. Okay. That's my uh, turn. Okay, I think I know generally how I want to approach this. Oh, this isn't like all the other freaking ones. So long. Where this is enough to take it out. It's not? You don't have a freaking weak point back here. Oh, what the lines. fuck? What the fuck, Time man? Duty, I actually have to... S oh my goodness. Right That's annoying you. as hell. Now. Fire. Oh, ever so close. Try to keep a grasp on your surroundings. Leave it to me. Really? Holy moly. Fire! And there we go. Good work. Keep it up. Finally.
We've broken through the enemy's defensive line. Sure, and current phase. See what they even do. They got a reinforcement coming in. Scout, eh? Okay. Horse. I sort of figured that wouldn't be very helpful. <laughs> yeah. Okay, she's just gonna stand there and take out the reinforcements as long as I need them to. <laughs> so the task after this is to take out their heavy tank, right? Mm. Okay, I think I know how how I want to do this. Way. Okay. Should be able to finish this turn. If my plans go correctly. Yeah, yeah, you're not good enough at a shot to actually significant damage. And occupying again. I hope this works. Oh, I hope this works. You okay, Alicia? I made you stand out there a bit longer than before. They didn't really have to do a whole lot of work after that, though. So... I hope my surprise attack works. <laughs> That's the idea, at the very least. It's a surprise attack. Alicia! Medic! Medic! What happened? It looks like Alicia's passed out. Can you get her back to base for me? Right, right, right. No, we already saw this technically. Okay. Yep, it's a it's a tra it's a trap for them, but we have a trap for them. It's a trap from them, but we have a trap for them. Words. Yes. Okay, where exactly are they? So is that one down there? Oh, we have snipers up here. Oh my goodness, that's a hell of a... I need to finish this this turn. I need to finish this this turn. And I have the trap set over here. Oh, fucking amazing. Entering combat. Boop. Boop. Hey, buddy. Is it really? Now! Oh my, okay. This might make take more turns than I uh anticipated. So what am I at? B. Okay, that's fine. I just need to take out both the heavy tanks. I don't even Here care about taking out all their other guys. Even though they they really would have the advantage in this situation if I didn't do the objective sort of strategy here. Fire! It is a little bit different though. Just considering the fact that, uh... One enemy tank neutralized! One to go, sir! Keep it up, everybody! It won't be long now! Oh, it should be fine. Hmm... I should have plenty. So I could... Here we go! Technically... <sighs> gotta love nature. Use my amazingly increased payload, you know? Now! Just to take out some of them, you know? <laughs> That's fun. Man down, everybody. Mm. 
Way ahead of you. do as much as I was hoping. Can I even get a good shot against it from this angle? Be sure to watch for return fire. I'm not sure I can. I think I might have to have to go down. Fire! Fire! We'll all be Leave it to me. No, I cannot. Oh, that makes this trickier. Trickier than I was hoping. Fire! Shit. Okay, this might not go how I wanted. Way ahead of you. Fly. Okay. Well, I want to... Let's see, best way to handle all these guys. <laughs> they have a lot of Lancers over there. Here, let's call some people in. Okay, let's see how they want to play this with... While well, missing one of them. Reinfo... More? Where? Going after milk. Yep. Okay, he's okay. He's okay. He's okay. Now! Surprised by how much that's in. Assume they're gonna do that. Oh my goodness. No, he's probably gonna go down. Ooh. Unless they, I guess maybe the depends if they want to go for another shot. Oh my. I do have a scout that could probably come and take the base right now if they really wanted to. He's taking a long route, though. Oh, of course they have multiple scouts. And they're both taking different directions. Okay, come on, guys. Don't, 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 don't. Don't actually take the base this turn. Come on. No. No, I see you. It's getting fucking close, though. It depends if they're willing to use their AP for this. So I'll just straight out take it. <laughs> How smart is the CPU, basically? Up, uh, shock trooper. Hiding. Oh, he just disappears into the grass. Don't attack, don't attack. No, oh, they're trying to keep a distance, interestingly enough. Are they gonna move their tank? I wonder. Because if they move their tank, I might actually have a shot of taking it out with the shamrock here next turn. Miss, miss, miss! Under light fire! <laughs> oh shit. Of course you. I, I purposely turn the freaking, uh. No. Fuck. They're using their AP. CP. 
Yep. Damn! We lost the base! Okay, well, I don't have much choice but to do that last turn a bit differently. Because I don't have enough people. I su well, I suppose I could... No, l let me load. I, I have an idea. The defense is starting to weaken! Where did that other scout come from? They had t I remember seeing two scouts run out of inbound. I reload and I only see the one here. Actually, would this be more reliable? Probably. Now! Good work. Keep uh. Okay. A bit confused, but okay. Okay. Call reinforcements. I'm not sure what happened with that scout there. Oh no, that's probably where the scout came from. They just had another reinforcements show up and it was had a fucking scout there. Shit. Uh. Mind you, if this doesn't work, then I think I'm gonna be forced to use orders to basically get Melville in a situation. Or maybe send Rosie in a situation where I can actually stop. I could also hide him better. Help! I'm... I could hide Millville better. Hmm. It's all because I took the goddamn Damn wrong minimal. route, really. In terms of trying to surprise attack over there. Hmm. Nope. Okay. I can't just take out their scouts before. Yep, he's gonna take it. Yep, okay. I think there's a way I have to do this Damn. at this point. Just based on where I last saved and such. Ah, shoot. Are all of you okay? Okay. So Damn. I tried. We lost I the base. I tried taking Melville and Rosie and basically setting them up to intercept these guys, but they had too many, and the scout basically just blew past. They have too much AP, and so okay. So the only solution I can think of back to where I actually loaded was to use orders to get Melville behind that tank and have him take it out. That's basically my. That's basically my only solution without going back much earlier in the battle. And trying it that way. Now! Woo! Woo okay, I'm not coming close to being able to get to where I need to be, so... Yeah, I think Requesting I need to redo backup. this, Repeat unfortunately. I definitely need to redo this. So basically the problem currently is that I don't really have much set up here, so they have several scouts that show up this next turn that I can't take out now that just beeline it for here, and I don't have enough defenses to basically stop them. Partially because if I hold up here, but partially because I'll need to like bring people out from being in reserve. The snipers take out Millville when he is there, and then it the other guys between the sniper that shows up here and the other guys if I try to bring them too far forward here those snipers still can hit us over here that's sort of the problem last time they took out a lot of Rosie and Melville's health and they had the sniper here 
and they basically just took out most of their health and they were able to take me out with the massive amount of AP that they had. So basically, I'm going to redo this, and I'm going to do this with my surprise attack actually making sense. Doing what I actually want to do for that surprise attack. Boom. I love that payload. Who are these guys? It works so ridiculously well. Are all of you okay? Okay, this should work better than it did previously. Should be simpler at the very least. Assuming... Okay, we're okay, we're okay. Uh, still trying to pull me into that trap. I'm gonna bring my motherfucking trap on you. Okay. This should go much more smoothly than it did last time. A ton more smoothly. Oh my goodness, I've seen this three times now. <laughs> Reinforcements, eh? Okay. So. Let's take care of up here first. Where That's the most important part. Enemy That's sighted. really the most important part. Really? Oh my goodness. Okay. The problem before was that I somehow Way fucking missed you. the weak spot. Fire! Oh my goodness. So let's just take one more over here. And I, yep, I will you. have enough to do the two shots that I need from Welkin's Sting to take out the other one. One enemy tank neutralized. One to go, sir. Keep it up, everybody. It won't be long now. No, it won't. For a very good reason this time. Very, very good reason. Assuming I don't Entering miss combat. it like I did somehow. Oh my goodness. How did I miss that? My goodness. Hostile sighted. Let's get the perfect shot. The, like, the chances of missing it are maybe zero. Fire! Okay. And this one should... I haven't even seen any Here of these move. Not even the other uh, setup. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, he actually missed it. I, I saved for a reason. I saved for a fucking reason. Oh my goodness, you actually fucking missed it point blank range. All you had to do was fucking shoot the weak point two times. And that's two times in a turn. Point. Oh my goodness. I, I saved after that first miss for a reason. Oh my goodness. Oh my fucking goodness. 
Okay, that one went down smoothly. Very smoothly. One enemy tank neutral <sighs> Fucking missing point blank shots. Really. I set this up for like the perfect scenario and you're missing point blank shots, my goodness. Go. Okay. Uh. Hostile sighted! Come on. This is probably too close. I, oh, I can get out far enough. And that should be a 100% chance. Fire! That should be a 100 motherfucking percent chance. Oh. Here we go! Come on. Game. Don't do this to me. Do not do this to me. Do not do this to me. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Operation complete. Both enemy tanks neutralized. Oh. I got an A because I, I set it up and I was a bit more efficient this time. So I would be doing it on the uh, third turn rather than the uh, fourth. But uh, again, I barely had enough turns to do it, which made misses. I could make do one miss. I had one miss. Ugh. And I, I saved right after and it was the perfect amount of turns to actually even... Oh my goodness. If I didn't... <laughs> if I had two misses... And I... Oh, I would have had to redo that all again. <laughs> because if I'm setting up for that strategy, then I leave myself immensely vulnerable that I basically have to finish it that turn whenever I, whenever they come around. <sighs> uh, <laughs> uh, Alicia, okay. The watershed battle on the Nagyar Plains ended in the victory of the Galian forces. I have no idea how the fuck that happens. It made military history not only with its ferocity, but with the duel that ended it. The Imperial Army then fell to retreat, while Gallia's grasp on victory tightened. Were we able to capture the Valkyria? We did, like, disarm her, or Alicia disarmed her. Alicia, are you alright? Welcome. I'm... What happened? I can't remember. What did... I was shot, wasn't I? But here I am, alive and fully healed. Well, let's not think about it too much for now. Thank goodness people don't have, like, smartphones. I could just imagine, like, the modern era of, like, her coming out there and then everyone just takes out their smartphone. Probably not on a battlefield, but still. <laughs> and it's like... Everyone looks at me differently now. Like they're scared. Welkin, did... Has something happened to me? Tell me, please! Alicia... How do you do that unconsciously, even? Report. Parting ways. Oh, this one doesn't have a battle. This one doesn't have a battle. Okay, guys, we can actually go through the mo rest of this, too. Unless this is, like, weirdly long. Sir, may I come in? Greece. any results on that thing I asked you to look into? I, I can imagine. Who, who else do we have to suspect but him? Yes, sir. For starters, this bullet you gave me. Its shape and markings perfectly match rounds used by an experimental Galleon sniper rifle. I see. So Alicia really was shot by someone inside the Galleon force. So, any leads on who fired it? I suppose we don't know about the death thing, so... Uh... Yes, sir. It... There's only one person who really has access to that, I presume? Why would you use an experimental sniper, a sniper rifle unless you want it tracked back to you? Tell me, Grease. Unless it's, like, so immensely better that it's, like, a sure shot. The night before the shooting, records show Lieutenant Lanzip checked out the rifle. What? Valdio had the gun? Are you sure that's not some mistake? 
It's rare for a tank commander to ask for a sniper rifle. So the clerk remembered him. Sir, only two of those rifles exist right now. One is confirmed to be locked in the arsenal. The other was checked out to Lieutenant Lanzett and has yet to be returned. I can't. It's hard for me to believe, too. Faldio? It couldn't be. I mean, it's pretty easy to imagine his reasoning, but not that Welkin or Kreese here have any sort of information to give, uh, create that same conclusion, like we do. Parting ways, though. You think he's gonna leave the military as a result of this? Hey, Faldio. You in? Have your pistol ready, Justin. I guess not. I wonder if he's, like, on AWOL. Uh. Notes on the Valkyrian race. The anthropology of the Valkyra. Uh-huh. <laughs> yep. Maybe he was reading up on the enemy. And realized something amazing. Horrible. All of the above. Hmm? This is his handwriting. Alicia must be made to awaken. What? Why would you write that down? Alicia must be made to awaken. No matter how much I try, I can think of no other way. I almost wish I had never joined them on that expedition to the Barius ruins. I'm convinced that the inner chamber was built to admit only Valkyra. But the door opened at her touch. That could only mean that the blood of their tribe courses through her veins. Still, I was shocked to find her bathed in that uncanny light that night in the field. Though I doubted my eyes, I never once doubted. That light was the Valkyrian blue flame. Ultimately, I had no choice but to accept the simple truth that Alicia is one of them. I'd already begun to question all I knew. The walls of the temple sanctum were inscribed with the Valkyrie's account of history. History as it truly was. We are all taught of the darks and calamity, and how their actions forever scorched the land. But this account told a different story. The Valkyrie invaded this land from the north, slaying the indigenous darks and people as they came. Their grasp of Ragnite technology and the art of war were vastly superior. The North? If this is supposed to be Europe equivalent... They trained the destructive power of Ragnite on the Darkson's land, burned it to ash, then had the gall to pass the blame for their inhuman deeds off on their Darkson slaves. Darksons have borne that stigma ever since, while the Valkyrie became godlike saviors. The victors simply rewrote the history books. The Barius ruins promulgate a lie to all but their own descendants as hard fact. Reading about the Valkyrie's power, the true face of these saviors, left me stunned. Yet at the same time, I can't help but think of how useful it could be to us now. I... I don't care about her background. She's obviously not the one who did it herself. Since then, I've investigated every text and report on the Valkyrie I could find. They lead me to believe that at least a few scions of the Valkyrie must have survived to this day. All across Europa, these rare individuals live and die unaware of their own nature. But history has recorded rare cases of individuals who have awakened to their powers. Their stories share one common thread. All of them suffered grave wounds before awakening. If those accounts are correct, the blood of the Valkyrie stirs at the approach of death. Their power, having slept for thousands of years, bursts awake at one step shy of the end. Once awakened, if one of these individuals takes hold of the refined Ragnite arms of their ancestors, they make their mark on history as one of the Valkyrie of old. 
I couldn't stop myself. I stole the Valkyrian lance and shield out of the university archive. Supposedly their blood serves to amplify the Ragnite's natural power. I have no idea what science lies behind it. Perhaps it's a consequence of their origins in the Ragnite-rich northern regions. Regardless of the reason, the Valkyria's life force itself calls forth a reaction from the stone. The enemy Valkyria decimated our forces on the Nagyar Plains. I could not afford to stay my hand on account of ethics. I had the rifle, and I forced myself to use it. Did he, like, write this down for Welcome the Find? I shot her. I placed the lance and shield on her unconscious form. I was racked with insecurity and guilt. Hands red with blood of my best friend's love. But now I know. The choice I made was right. Faldio! Yeah, that's not... Hello, Lieutenant Gunther. Is something wrong? Faldio! Where is he? Arrest him if you find him. Make sure you get the word out that he is... This is something that he needs to be arrested for, at the very least, and brought in. He should not be... He should not be allowed to walk freely at the moment. I understand his logic, but that's not a decision he makes for the person. Sir! Captain Verrat just called him in. He left only a minute ago. <laughs> Pull out your pistol, put a gun to his head. Faldio, I'm only going to ask you this once. Was it you who shot Alicia? Yeah. I shot her. <laughs> Tell me why. Why did you have to shoot her? The people. Galia needed her. Now let me ask you a question. How else do you think we could have won that battle? If not for Alicia's power, Galia would have most certainly lost. I still can't. And not just this battle. I'm talking about Galia's future. How else are we supposed to survive, Welkin? Caught on either side by giants. It's Alicia. Our Valkyria. She's the only one who can protect us from them. Wrong. Our side gaining power won't end this war. All it does is escalate the conflict. That's enough. Listen to each other. You may both be right. But still, you're both very wrong. I don't claim to have the perfect answer either. However, regardless of the reason, attacking one of your own comrades is deplorable. Yes, that. By Galleon military law, I remand you to the stockade until further notice, Faldio. And you, Welkin. 24 hours in isolation for engaging in fisticuffs. Oh, that's more than a... Fine. Worth it. Yes, he needs to have consequence. It, it doesn't matter if he thinks it's the right thing. You don't just... Chapter 15. Citadel Girlendio. You don't just lose responsibility for your actions on that sort of basis. You still, like, like, whenever people talk about martyrs, it's like, like doing something like self sacrificial for the greater good. Like, I, I don't know, a good example is not coming to mind. But it's like, at the same time, it's like, if you're willing to be a martyr in order to achieve a goal, then don't just. Then you have to be able to own up to being a martyr, then. You have to be able to be a martyr, essentially. You have to be willing. You need to be willing to actually take responsibility for your actions, because a civilization doesn't just work like, Oh, well, okay, well, you had a reason you thought was justified, okay. Well, yeah, okay, no consequences. It's okay this time. Because at that point, it doesn't... Matt, like, everyone 
like every single reason a person, a, someone does everything they do for a reason they believe is justified. People don't do things if they don't think it's justified. See, that's the thing that pisses me off the more. Not just about forcing her into that situation, it's the fact that he shot her. I don't think he didn't expect any consequences. But... Welkin's not even focusing on that at all. Like, you fucking shot her. My goodness. Thanks to the victory at Nagyar, our forces have pushed the enemy back to the border. The Imperials are currently holed up in the Citadel at Girlendio. Girlendio? And one that's at the border? Ooh, <laughs> that seems fortified. A crucial checkpoint along the commerce routes tying Gallia to the east since medieval times. The pass at Girlendio had been fortified for ages. The existing structure was rebuilt as a modern fortress during the First European War, and its grounds were littered with the casualties of war. In the current war, it housed the Empire's command center, and now it stood as their final stronghold. I mean, ultimately, I'm still just surprised that we won that battle in the end, even with her. I figured it might end up being a stalemate or some shit. What's our strategy for attacking the Citadel, Captain? Hmm. I still haven't received any details on our orders from above yet. Oh, stop your worrying, Verat! I came here myself to give you your orders! Oh, for fuck's sake. General Damon? I'm honored, but why not just send a messenger? Your regiment really showed him up out there at Nagyar! In return, I'm granting you the honor of assaulting the Citadel at the van of the army. Sir? Here are your orders. There's a supply line running into the Citadel. We're sending a train car loaded down with explosives along it to blow us an entrance. The militia will run along the track ahead of it, flipping the right rail switches. Flipping rail switches, sir? Oh. Okay, yeah, that seems a little weird. This, while dodging a hailstorm of bullets? That sounds like a suicide mission, sir. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's the perfect challenge for your fearless crew. If we succeed here, the Empire will finally be forced out of Gallia for good. You'll pave the way for the real army. You got that, Farat? I roll. I have the boy. Damn it! Another mission they don't have the guts to do themselves. Uh, who are you? Hi. <laughs> Maybe, but it's a mission that somebody still needs to do. Precisely, as the general said, if we win, the empire will be driven out of Gallia. Let this be our final battle. I'll await good news from the field. Dismissed. Is Damon the general of the army just in general? Or is he of the militia? Because it seems like he's wearing a militia uniform, but I could be completely wrong about that. Hmm. The cruelest order. It's too late for the mother. Come on, we've got to get the child out. Now! Mother, where are you? Mother! Mother! Savari, I'm... Sorry. Your Grace. I was going to get Savari, but it's him? Hmm. hmm. That incident grows old and stale. Savaria, what news have you from the front? Sire. They seek to push our soldiers past the border, and the total of their forces approach those of our own. I see. The advantage now begins to sway towards the other side. 
It seems the loss at Nagyar has ended our hopes of strolling through the gates of Rondkreis. The fault lies with me. This would be over had I but won at Nagyar. Your grace, grant me another chance, I beg you. Please allow me to fight for your glory, sire. Hmm. I can't imagine him saying no. Dear Silvaria, do you truly wish to be of help? Oh. Yes, more than anything. From the time you saved me, your grace, I've... Known that I love you more than I do my own life. Sire, I want to work in the service of your dreams. Very well. So, Silvaria, you report that the strength of our opponent now matches our own. In that case, let the fire of destruction rain down upon them. Use the final flame of the Valkyria. But... Is that like self-sacrificial? Oh, I bet that does. Your grace! The hour of your death shall mark the inauguration of our rule. Farewell, Silvaria. Oh boy. It's the only option they oh my goodness. <sighs> of course there's poop jiggle. Of course there's poop jiggle. Can't say I'm impressed, Your Grace. Making a lady cry? This is simply one of a number of scenarios we'd planned for since before Nagyar. If her prowess as a Valkyria is insufficient. Selvaria's uses quickly narrow to one alone. <laughs> anyway, there's a messenger here for you straight from Castle Randgreys. So there is. Let him wait. I have no time for simple messengers now. We are set to commence Operation Steel Scythe. Jaeger, prepare to return back east. What? Then it's... The Marmota's finished? It is. Word has come that it has completed its trial run. The Galleons are hasty to assume victory. We shall see them gutted yet. Uh, the bigger tank, I'm sure. I'm sorry. Okay, I think... Now, I'll finish up the scenes at the very least. I did say I wanted to try for a longer episode, I suppose. Is everybody here? No. Still no Alicia, boss. Right. Well, let's start. I already heard from another squad. We're prepping some tracks for a bomb. That's right. It's a rough one, but this is a critical mission. Ah, uh, this is the militia. We're used to getting all the bum missions by now. With that settled, there's one question I gotta ask you, boss. Alicia's Valkyria powers and all. You plan to use those this time, too? No, Largo, of course I don't. I have faith in your natural abilities. Who needs Valkyra when I've got you all? Good answer. I'd expect no less from you, boss. We're ready for anything out there. After all, this could very well be it. Yeah, we're fine. You go be with Alicia, boss. She needs you real bad right now. All right. You all know what you're doing. Do they? <laughs> Does he? This is a tough one. Even for nature, boy. Having Alicia and the boss moping around is a drag for the whole squad. I hope for everyone's sake they can pull out of this funk real soon. Is that, we want, is that what we want to call it? A funk? Alicia, there you are. What's up? 
Look at this, Welkin. Guess what? I found some lion's paw growing while I was out on my walk. There you go. Very sharp. Makes you look like a real gentleman. Uh, well, thank you. Welkin. They said it was Valdio. Is it true? Afraid so. Then when I... When I walked through camp before... Some of them got down on their knees. Oh, like that would be... Worshiping me. That would be horrible. Praise the Valkyria. The Godchild. They... They were... Begging me to save Galia. Me. I mean... What am I supposed to say to that? Alicia, I... What kind of life can... Can I live from now on? A baker? I, I bet Valkyrias make the best variety. I wish variety. I knew. <sighs> wow, I'm sorry. Guess that was pretty heavy. Here we are, right before the last battle, and I'm not helping things one little bit. Don't worry about me. Sergeant Alicia Melkiot, sir. Reporting. And ready for duty. My mind is focused on the mission. See you later, boss. Yeah, that's not believable. Alicia. Cool. Okay, well, not much choice there. This little, so there's obviously two parts to the fight here. Oh, this is giving me a long one, eh? Okay, well... Okay, well, I think I'm going to leave it there. Honestly... Uh, I don't know. She, I guess she just doesn't know what to make of it. Obviously, it's her choice what she wants to do. If she doesn't want to do that, then she doesn't have to do that. She might feel forced into it if there's no other choice, though. I don't even know if she can control it. If she's remotely near there. I'm sure it certainly came way out of nowhere for her. Hmm. Okay, well. Next time, we'll fight for Galand uh, Galandiao. 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 Fuck, I don't remember how they pronounce it. Whatever. <laughs> what a name, though. Um. Yeah. Okay. I'll see you all next time. Drive safely, everyone. <laughs>